to our channel RG Automobile, a channel of video on which we discuss about each and every part of an automobile. So in order to that, today we are going to discuss about a very interesting topic that is universal joint. A universal joint is a part of a transmission system. The universal joint is connected between the gearbox and propeller shaft as well the propeller shaft and differential. With the help of this joint, angular moment can be possible. So, if you want to learn about the universal joint, please watch our video till the very last second. So guys, our today's topic is universal joint. In a simple form, a universal joint consists of two yokes. First yoke and second yoke. Each of which is attached to one end of the shaft. Like this one is the first shaft which is connected to this yoke and this one is the second shaft which is connected to this yoke. And the another thing is a central piece or connecting cross piece joint through which the two yokes are joints. Like this one is a cross piece and these yokes are joined through this cross piece with the help of these bearings. With the help of these bearings, these yokes can move up and down. So guys, when the shafts are operating at a different angle, it do not transmit the power uniformly. That's why we use the universal joint. With the help of the universal joint, we can get around 180 degree of the rotation. Likewise, if this one is the first yoke and this one is the second yoke, so you can have a look here first yoke and rotate around 180 degree and the second yoke two around 180 degree means with the help of this universal bearing we can get almost 180 degree rotation so guys what happened is when our cars are moving and uh, we got a sudden bump at that time some amount of the angularity and the propeller shaft is takes place and because of that maybe our propeller shaft can break and with the help of the universal joint our propeller shaft can be saved how actually because the universal joint provides the angularity between the shafts like so guys the universal joints are basically used in between the gearbox and propeller shaft as well in the propeller shaft and differential so if you take an example of gearbox and propeller shaft then this shaft is connected with the gearbox and this one is connected with propeller shaft so guys when the bump comes it gives the angularity motion means if this shaft is in its axis and the propeller shaft can move around its axis means it can move upward or the downward so this is the universal joint through which our propeller shaft can work properly so guys this is the simple form of a universal joint now we are going to have a look on the different types of universal joint so first one is a flexible hardy coupling joint it is a kind of a universal joint second one is a hooks or ring type universal joint and third one is a muff coupling and then fourth one is a yoke type of universal joint fifth one is a hardly spider needle bearing type universal joint and then the lay rub coupling joint and Last but not the least, constant velocity universal joint. So thanks for watching guys our today's video. If you like our video and you if you learn something from our video, so please give us a big fat thumbs up and share with your friends and subscribe our channel. Okay guys, bye bye. I will see you to the next week.